everyone, I'm Rachel Lopez and this is the channel Rachel Lopez. I know I'm not wearing a v-neck, it's just my microphone. I would never recommend a sin that great. Today I'm gonna educate you guys on a little bit of facts and knowledgeables about beagles, the best little friends. I actually have a beagle myself, his name is Jax, we got him a few months ago, he's still a puppy, and he just pees. He pees everywhere, my house is just an ocean of pee, urine. Um, <laughs> some of these facts are reason why beagles are starting to go out of style actually, why people aren't getting them as much. And I'm not trying to make like a diss track of beagles, I think they're actually really great, but you do need to know some facts about your breed before you get some because a lot of breeds have very unique characteristics about them that can make or break your deal with them. That's why a lot of people don't want their dogs after they get them. For example, chihuahuas will latch on to one person and just like stay with that one person for the rest of their lives and hate everyone else. And poodles, they need to get their hair trimmed like every six weeks professionally sometimes or also get like fleas and infections, the more you know. <laughs> anyway, here's 10 facts you should know about beagles. One, they are one of the hardest breeds to train. Uh, they can be trained, it just takes a little longer, sometimes up to six months. Uh, usually requires a little bit more work. But in the end, beagles are some of the most loyal and sweet dogs that you will ever find, so it is worth it. The reason they are so hard to train is because they are very stubborn dogs, and if they don't want to do something, then they just won't do it, you know? Like, if Jax runs under the bed, and no matter how much coaxing, how much threatening we do, he will not come out unless we give him a treat, because he doesn't care if you're coaxing or threatening him, he just wants a treat, you know? That's what makes him happy. He doesn't care if it makes you happy that he comes out of the <laughs> that comes from under the bed. They naturally do what they want to do. You have to train them to want your affection, unlike other dogs who will do that naturally. Two, beagles are, have a very one-track mind. This can be either good or bad. Good meaning that if they are biting you or being mean, just put a toy in their mouth and they'll become intricately distracted. Boom, problem solved. <laughs> it can be bad if you're like petting him and every five seconds it's just like, cat, right, tree, and bone. Three. Beagles are smell averse, meaning that they largely sense the world with their nose. Like as humans, we are taste averse. You think it would be eyes, but no, it's taste. Beagles smell everything. Like going on walks with Jax when he was learning how to was really hard because sometimes he would just get distracted because he was smelling different smells. If he smelled a duck, he was going to get that duck. That's why it's good to have a retractable leash. Wow. If he runs away, you can just catch it and catch them so that you can have them at their sides the whole time and you can also let them roam around while they're still on the leash and they won't get away. Never have your dog off leash in public that isn't like a dog park because if they smell something they will just and you never get them back. It's a good thing to get animals to do what they're most predisposed to do meaning uh, get beagles into smelling games. One game that we play with Jax is called seek and we hide three treats in a room and tell them to go seek and he will have to find them with his nose, seek them out, and then he'll get to eat them. Sometimes he gets so excited that he pees. You gotta teach him how to go pee outside. They don't do that naturally. No dogs do that naturally, actually. Cats do that naturally. If you want an easy pet, get a cat. Four, beagles are actually a very calm breed. The males are a bit calmer than their females and you can get them neutered, they settle down even more. So they're great for kids and get along with animals like cats and birds, I guess. We have a cat named Rave and they don't like each other but they don't fight and that's good enough five beagles love to be mentally stimulated and no i don't mean electrically shocked get them into like little brain toys you know we got this toy that dispenses treats if jacks moves the right pieces together get them on chewy they're great they get keep them distracted keep them from chewing on furniture get them little bones too it helps them with teething get that's for all dogs six Beagle hygiene, hygiene is super easy. You bathe them every five weeks, clip their nails every two weeks if you want to, give them a little breath fresh mint foam, which are these. You can get them anywhere. You can get them at Walmart, actually. They keep their breath fresh and you don't have to brush their teeth and you don't have to groom them or cut their hair because they, they have short hair and they barely shed. Seven, beagles like water. We have a pool in our backyard and Jax loves to swim. You can take your beagle to a lake to a river, to a nudist beach, they'll like it. Eight, beagles are not picky eaters. This probably goes for all dogs, but beagles will literally eat anything. The way to get them focused on their dog food was to mix leftovers into their dish, but 
they are prone to obesity and allergies, so not a lot. <laughs> Nine, beagles are very curious animals, and this probably goes for all dogs as well, but mostly beagles. They will get into your stuff, they will chew it into oblivion, they are, will give you up, they will let you down, they are gonna run around, and they will, they will desert you. <laughs> no, not really. But Jax did once chew up my psychology notes like three days before my exam and the printer was broken and like, ah. They will get into your stuff, completely non-malicious intentions, so um, hide your daughters. Ten. Beagles need a routine. Have them on a schedule for bathroom breaks, walks, meal times, snaps, everything. The more structures their lives have, the better trained they will be and the better behaved they will act. That's 10 facts you should know about beagles before you decide to get one. Decide to get any dog, really. I love beagles. They're great. I think they're the cutest dog you can get. Uh, check out my podcast on Spotify or wherever you listen to music. It's called Going Great with a little cat emoji con on the cover. Basically follows the same content I have here on YouTube, maybe a little bit more. I just started it. <laughs> if you like listening more than watching, go check that out. Comment on your pet facts below, maybe. Uh, like and subscribe to the video. Bye!